just wanted to do a quick Facebook Live to talk about some questions that some of our um, course, uh, sorry, our students, I'm trying to fix my glasses. Oh, well, it's been one of those days. <laughs> some of our students have, and potential students have brought to the table, and I wanted to just take a few minutes here to go ahead and answer those. I'm looking to see if people can hear me. Can you hear me? I've got people over here. All right, my people say you can hear me. Um, so anyways, what a really incredible experience this has been <laughs> launching the uh, Multi-Channel Marketing Academy. As I've told you through our marketing and through our webinar, et cetera, this is something that has been in the works for over a year at Verity. We have put a lot of time and effort into this. And once uh, COVID-19 reared its head, we basically, like so many people, pivoted. And we wanted to go ahead and create this as a blueprint of sorts that could help guide a specialty brand leader through the process of keeping up with or even hopefully ahead of their target consumer. And we have discovered just a ton through this entire process in terms of where brands are, the type of help that they need. Um, I'll be, I just want to reiterate, while we did create this content over the course of the last year, all the way up until and through right now, it's not like it's been sitting on a shelf since last December or something. We were literally getting ready to launch it in April. So we really felt the opportunity to pivot and, and make it a great resource for um, people going through the crisis to try and connect with, reach, and serve their target consumer during a time when that consumer is changing so much and also during a time when traditional distribution of product and content is changing as well because consumers are changing because of the constrictions of COVID-19, et cetera. There's so many, so many factors at play much, very much a moving target. So I wanted to go ahead and just spend a few minutes here and talk about some of the questions that we're getting um, with the hope that that clears up anything that you might need. Um, this will be on our page afterward as well if you'd like to share it. And you're also welcome to just reach out to us. Um, I'll have a way to do that at the end of the Facebook Live here today. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and just start hitting these questions. Number one, this is a commonly asked question. When does the course begin? So I know a number of you understand that this is a digital course and in your mind that means things are recorded and I can access that anytime. And yes, that's true. We are dripping the content, which means it's not gonna be fully available right all at once. So assuming you join this week, which you have to because our deadline is Friday, as in this Friday at midnight, we're going to have modules one and two up and then I will be actually teaching tomorrow night on Wednesday, which I'm so excited about, at 5.30 Mountain Time. So I'll be jumping in to our closed Facebook group and teaching modules one and two tomorrow night. And then uh, we have a schedule in there in terms of the twice a week live interaction you have, and we'll have a person inside the Facebook group who will be acting as a community manager throughout the time that you're in the course. So that's uh, basically, if you join anytime this week, you will have modules one and two active and ready and also you'll have access if you're not on live for my training on wednesday at 5 30 tomorrow um you'll have the recording so i'm reading to see just to make sure i hit all the points in this question yes okay so we're actually going to put module three up on monday june 1st so we're going to almost we're going to build our catch-up week in next week so that everybody who enrolls all the way up until this friday will have the opportunity to get through one and two um, we also have our first guest lecturer next Tuesday. And um, yeah, we have a bunch of things planned for the next, you know, this week and next week. So people joining all the way up until this Friday will be able to get caught up, get their legs under them, be able to do some of the pre-work. And then we go out of the gates uh, on Monday, June 1st with module three together. All right. How much of this course is live and how much is recorded? I just covered some of that, but um, the modules themselves, the seven modules are recorded. And then we have uh, worksheets and handouts that go with those. And every week I teach on for an hour and a half on Wednesday at 5.30, which I would love to do, I'm super excited about. You're welcome to send questions in advance. We are going to be doing what we call hot seats during that time, which is basically taking um, somebody who has worked on something and wants to share it with the group and, or has an issue or an obstacle. And we're going to basically teach and train around that for the benefit of the whole group. I have one of the most, the things I'm so excited about is the network that will be in this Facebook community. These people are so excited to just 
learn and stretch themselves and really try and modernize through the crisis. They have the exact right mindset. And I feel like I am excited to surround myself with with A players like this because I know it's going to keep all of us elevating and continuing to evolve through this crisis. We are all beyond busy. That is one of the reasons why we've made this digital course available where you can consume the content when it works for you, but I know you're going to get a lot out of it if you're able to do some of the live interaction as well. No, everything will be recorded. All of it will be recorded, so you can actually consume it on your own time frame. But if you need more or you want to have a hot seat or whatever, that is definitely available to you. Okay. Um, all right, I think I got that one. Let's see. Another question that I have is, <clears throat> it says, um, how much time do you estimate I'll need to put into the course over the eight weeks? all elements of the course. And that kind of goes back to what I was just talking about. It really depends on if you're going to want the live coaching and engagement. Um, we've definitely not purposely tried to just completely overload you with, with um, content. There are a couple of beefy modules, but we basically made the content more, the training more succinct and did a couple more worksheets so that it really will be contained to, I would say, two to four hours a week. I would say sweet spot, two and a half hours a week. If you want more coaching and training, it can be as high as four hours a week. But again, this could vary from student to student. Please know this is our very first time putting this out there, okay? You'll never ever have the opportunity to get this course for the price that we're offering it. And you'll probably not have as much access to me because this is my baby and I'm gonna be in there and make sure that this is entirely relevant to the people who sign up and raise their hand to immerse themselves in this content, I'm going to be right there helping them. So while I may not be there every day sitting next to them while they're doing their content, I'm going to be very visible in that Facebook group. I'll be teaching every week for an hour and a half. And I will also be doing office hours. What we're going to do is basically have Friday afternoons where I will either be doing office hours or we'll have a guest lecturer. So going through the eight weeks, Wednesdays and Fridays are the live components. So I'd say two to four hours is a, is a fair answer. The next question, how much does the course cost? So obviously I just mentioned this, but we're offering it at 497 and that is down from 1997. Um, and the reason being is so much time, so much expertise, all the training we've paid for for ourselves, all of the 20 years of experience with over 200 brands that we've worked with, and the playbook that we've created from Channel Mastery, literally can't, you can't find that anywhere else. Um, and that's one of the reasons I feel so proud of and so sure of selling this um, solution for you because it has literally been hand built and it is completely unique for specialty brands. And you're able to get that all for 497 right now. And we just added a three pay option because we're very sensitive to the fact that any expense right now is difficult. Um, so we're hoping that that has made this accessible to you. Um, and, at, and again, we're offering two payments of 265 or three payments of 176. You'll see that on the checkout page. So that's what's up with that one. And then another question that we had that just actually came in this morning that I thought was really good is um, how relevant is the course if I offer a service versus a product? So a service versus a widget. Um, I've also seen this come in from our uh, community of, you know, guides or people who run services that offer like outdoor experiences, et cetera. There are, uh, this definitely works um, for those types of companies as well, because you are targeting a consumer. Okay. Um, we've implemented some of the tactics that we train in this course for B2B. And we also have had a lot of success with B2C on both widgets and, and services. What we're offering is a, basically a framework that you can use to continue to establish your brand's growth and relevancy to consumers as they're evolving and as your brand continues to grow. Um, so ultimately this framework can be used for widgets, products and services, as well as people who take people out to have adventures or do events. So I, I feel very strong and confident standing behind it in that way. Let's see, I also have a question um, a couple of times I've been asked this because I have been doing some phone calls with people who have questions, which I'm happy to do. Um, 
we've had a question come in where basically somebody within a team on a brand or you know a, an organization is asking is it okay if i'm the only person who's taking this can i should i enroll other people on my team it's really a case by case basis uh, but please know there are facets of this like um we do go over a training on how to create a budget for a multi-channel marketing effort and content effort obviously you take the template and you make it work within your organization um, and then you might be the person who spearheads that. But the ultimate goal that we see here is, and again, once we get through training this and teaching this, it may evolve a little bit, but the goal that we see right now is enabling brands to have a champion for the consumer inside. And while you may think that you have that and that's great, there's also pre-COVID where a lot of the infrastructure and, and legacy framework of how you brought concept to consumer with product or service a lot of what we build inside our organizations is basically protecting the distribution. And we have prioritized that over consumers. We have tried to fight, fight, fight to keep distribution over here and make the consumer conform to that. That can't happen anymore. So this is, is designed to be an immersive digital course that teaches you how to have an in-house consumer advocate who's reporting in on how consumers are interacting with and engaging with your content and your products. Um, you're basically going to be giving a, a framework on how to do that and how to hold these meetings and ultimately become that champion and get that seat at the table with your leadership team. That is super, super important to get that buy-in of your leadership peers to actually steer the company towards servicing and serving remarkably your end consumer versus um, the point of distribution, frankly. So that's um, something that it is a kind of a case by case basis. It depends on how large the company is, where you are in that trajectory, how COVID has affected your business, et cetera. So if you wanna have like a one-on-one, -on -one, I'm happy to do a conversation with you on that front. Um, great. So I think that those are the questions that we have so far. A lot of them revolve around time, around investment, et cetera. When you consider the investment, consider the fact that you're going to be getting a framework and you're going to have it informed with a huge amount of experience and heart. Okay. We care so much about the people who are choosing to join this course with us and choosing to spend their time with us during this incredibly important time. Um, just know that we want nothing more than to have your back. So, um, all right. I think that that is all that I have now, but please know that I will also be doing another Facebook Live, I believe at 11 o'clock Mountain Daylight Time on Friday to answer more questions. And you're also welcome to, um, I guess, email us or find us on social media. Um, you could always, I think it's mcma at veridapr.com, if I'm not mistaken. I want to quickly check that with my amazing team. But I think that that's the email. But please know we'll put it in this Facebook post. We'll let you know how to get a hold of us or you can just DM us on Facebook. All right. Thanks, everybody. It was great to connect. Um, I hope to see you inside the course. Thank you so much.